guys, it's Rianne, and today I'm going to be showing you how I do my messy bun. The first thing that you'll need is a straightener. You'll need a brush. I use BioSilk Serum for my hair. Some dry shampoo and some hairspray. First, you're going to want to heat up your straightener. I slept with my hair up in a bun, but I had to redo the bun before I went in the shower to make sure all of my hair was up. Then I brush out my hair. This will help so that way the hair will be a little bit more voluminous and when you're twisting it into the bun it won't get knotted or anything like that. So when you're done brushing out your hair, the next thing you're going to do is put your BioSilk Serum in your hair or whatever serum you're using. I just like to put a little product on the ends in order to make it look a lot more healthy and give it a little bit of hydration. So I work that mostly into the ends of my hair and then I try to get most of the body at the bottom as well. You really don't want to put this near your roots though because that will make it look a little bit more greasy and that's definitely not what we're going for. After I put my serum in, I port my hair in the middle. This is just to segregate it into a left and right section. I'm going to start with my left section and I'm going to take a little chunk next to my ear and I'm going to flip all of the hair away from there so I can get a better grip on it. And I'm just going to take my straightener and straighten really, really close to my head. And the reason I do this is because while I'm sleeping, um, my hair around my face tends to curl up. It's probably also because, you know, when I wash my face, I probably get some water in my hairline and also the steam when I take a shower. So I do this in order to re-straighten out my hair because I have naturally curly hair. So this is something that I have to do if I want my hair to look straight, especially when it's by my hairline. I don't straighten any other parts of my hair though because they can hold the straightness pretty well um, but for some reason the hair near my face just doesn't so I just do that quickly on each side and you can't really tell but um, in person you can definitely see that the left side looks way more straightened out than the right side. So I'm just going to go ahead and repeat that on the other side. Okay, so when I finish with that, I'm going to turn off my flattening iron because I won't need it anymore, and I'm going to get my dry shampoo. I've been loving this Tresemme dry shampoo lately. So now I'm going to section off my hair much like I did before, but in a little bit more of a messy fashion, and I'm going to lift up the hair and spray under it with the dry shampoo. And the reason I do that is because I don't want the hair on top to come in direct contact with the dry shampoo, just because sometimes it can leave sort of a powdery residue but I do try and use my fingers to get it all the way up to the roots and as you can see that adds a lot more volume. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that around my entire head. And just using my fingers I massage it to evenly disperse it on my scalp. This is really great and it makes my scalp feel so clean even though I didn't wash it. I'm one of those people who can't go for very long without washing their hair so um, this is really great for me. So now I'm going to put my hair in a high ponytail and I'm going to hold my hand about an inch and a half above my scalp and then push down, which will create a lot of volume. And then I'll twist the body of the ponytail and it will naturally go into the bun. And you just wrap it around really messily. And then I take my fingers and pull out any sections that look like they don't have enough volume. And just take the rubber band and put it around the bun like you would a ponytail. And then I pull it out a little bit and you're really done after that. Um, and then I pull out a few wispies if I want to. And then I take my hairspray and I hairspray it down because we do want some flyaways but not too many. And then throughout the day if it gets messier it will just add to the look. So it's really simple and really easy and it's definitely a carefree style. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll talk to you next time. Bye guys!